disposal and recycling, community conscious, environmentally friendly. We do that. In today's business world, environmental policy is a key issue. Rogue Disposal and Recycling has chosen to look at these environmental laws as minimum standards to be embraced, practiced with conscience, and ultimately exceeded. One of the largest landfills in Southern Oregon, Dry Creek Landfill, was opened in 1972 and is a self-contained facility. Waste is placed into highly compacted interlinked cells, each cell being lined with a composite of a 60 mil thick high-density polyethylene HDPE liner material, a geosynthetic low permeability soil liner, a 40 mil thick HDPE liner, and finally a second 60 mil thick HDPE liner. Any contaminated water that reaches the liner system is transferred to a leachate collection system, which removes it from the landfill for disposal at the wastewater treatment plant. This comprehensive engineered design exceeds the environmental standards of the US EPA. As it stands now, Dry Creek receives approximately 900 tons of material a day, and with a 50 million ton capacity, ensures local capacity while providing a regional solution to waste disposal. If the influx of material continued to increase at a rate proportional to population growth, the site could maintain viability for well over its projected life of 75 years, while staying within its designated 300-acre footprint. On September 28, 2007, Rogue Disposal and Recycling held a building dedication and ribbon cutting ceremony at the Dry Creek Landfill. The occasion? Its gas to energy plant came online. This facility is only the third to have been built in Oregon and is the first in over 10 years. How does it work? Landfill gas, which is 50% methane, is collected via an integrated network of vacuum wells, which have been set into the landfill from which the gas is transferred to a centralized point where it is cleaned and dewatered before it is burned in two 20-cylinder internal combustion engines. Burning 1,080 cubic feet of landfill gas a minute and creating 3.2 megawatts 24-7, the gas to energy facility provides enough power to service 3,000 households every year, the equivalent of 20,000 tons of coal. And as time passes, the energy producing potential increases. This energy generated is sold to Pacific Corp. The gas to energy facility also creates green tags now each green tag is equal to 1,000 kilowatt hours of fossil fuel energy, which Rogue Disposal sells to the Bonneville Environmental Foundation for marketing to utility customers. The proceeds of which are used to fund projects, such as a 400 megawatt wind farm in Washington, tidal and wave energy research on the Oregon coast, and solar projects near Klamath. In the final estimation, each green tag prevents the release of 1,000 pounds of carbon dioxide into the atmosphere. U.S. Senator Ron Wyden observes that this is exactly what we need to green up our energy portfolio in Oregon. This green business venture was made possible using tax credits created from a 2005 energy bill. Rogue Disposal and Recycling will continue to protect the public health and welfare of our community, to set the standard for environmental policy. From the curbs of our homes and our businesses, we'll strive to create clean air, clean water, and clean energy for everyone. As you look out over Southern Oregon's wealth of beauty and natural resources, understand that you have a company working for you, acting as steward and trust holder. We do that. Every day. Every week every year for your families your businesses for you rogue disposal and recycling community conscious environmentally friendly for today and all of our tomorrows